called Departure. Some of y'all might have seen it in a certain oh, literary oh. magazine. Oh. Thank you. Oh. Wow. What? Departures. <laughs> Strange. How we discuss death funny. over dinner. Uh. Nine Nine crushes the passing of a loved one as a walking away, as if someone meant to join us for a meal. We're caught up elsewhere. Auntie Fang nods to herself. She was at the wake the night before and cannot forget how young the body had looked. Uncle Yang is his usual self. Quiet, reserved, but slightly quiet. Father is the last to hear the news. I watch him mix regret with shock under his tongue and shape a prayer waiting to be uttered. He swallows a mouthful of rice and asks, How old? 58, Nine replies. She had cancer, but was still active. So young, Father explained. His voice having an age that brings new silence. Someone sighs, can't be helped. People come, then quickly go. Hits pop uncertainly, and then in agreement, as a bowl of fruit is placed amidst the unfinished dishes. We each take a slice, but delay clearing our plates. But we have all finished, but cannot bear to oh. Okay, and then, um, since we are going home tomorrow, okay. uh, the last one, the second one is one that I wrote some time ago, it's indoors, you can find it. It's on the last page, Whoa. called Nightlight. Oh. Returning home, the apartment block looks like a toilet with three lighted cubicles. Fluorescent pours through identical windows holding neighbours worlds apart from one another like mahjong players shielding their towels or children smuggling candy. Life pauses as laughter erupts from two cells simultaneously and suddenly the night is a little bit brighter. Nice.